Hey everyone, this is Ellen from Made Whole Nutrition and I want to explain to you today how you can break up a bundle into individual Canva files. Um, this is mainly helpful if you just want to have them as individual files on Canva or if you want to download them as individual files that you can then search on your computer. Um, this especially applies to handouts that are meant to be um, a landscape orientation. So I will kind of show this to you. Um, first of all, if you just want to take a simple handout um, and make it as an individual file, you copy everything. I do Command C and then um, create a new Canva document. I usually do resume because it's eight and a half by 11 already. And then paste. Um, it's kind of the opposite of making a bundle where you would copy an individual handout and paste into one single document. Um, so you just have to go down and, and do that for each one. Um, you can, you know, rename it as you want, um, whatever you, whatever you would like. Um, I will say this is most helpful, like I said, for the landscape documents. So for example, if you purchase a, a large handout bundle, like um, the, the all handouts bundle, as you're seeing now with all the handouts included, and, and there's these that are showing up sideways, um, what you wanna do, so I'm gonna delete the sample because that will throw it off. Um, you wanna select everything. Again, create a new document. Um, just resize it as 11 and a half or create it with those dimensions to start. Um, and then paste. It's gonna still be sideways, so you turn everything while it's still highlighted and then just drag it to the right size. And there you go. Um, now it's the correct orientation. If you want to, um, yeah, have it in this orientation. Alternatively, you can simply download all of these handouts as the PDF file. Um, so what I mean by that is if I'm still in the bundle, I go to download. There's two different types of PDFs, standard and print. I'm honestly not sure what the difference is. They both seem to work um, the same way. So if I'm downloading this entire file, it's gonna go onto the desktop and then I can work from this file. So if I open it up um, on a Mac, it shows the thumbnails over here. If it, if it doesn't on your computer, just make sure you have thumbnails um, selected. And then you can drag each of these onto your desktop and, and create individual PDF documents. Um, here they are, here's three of them at least. Um, if you wanna rename them, you know this is the fat and oil guide there you go. Now you can search it on your computer. Um, and it, it's nice to have these as individual PDFs if you want to upload them onto like a, a pra, uh, um, like a client management software um, just to stay organized. Oh, there we go. Um, alternatively, um, you can simply search these on Canva. So if you, if you just want to have them in a searchable format, I don't think I would recommend creating individual files for all these handouts, especially not if you're working on the all handouts bundle, um, you, because Canva's pretty good at searching. So for example, if I'm looking for this constipation handout, I can just search that on Canva. It found the handout, it found a bundle that, that it was in, um, it found that word on several other handouts. And so um, you, can, you can simply search that way if you want. Um, finally, say, say I have one of those landscape handouts, um, uh, that I didn't bother to create a new Canva file. I simply downloaded the bundle. If I have it, you know, as an individual PDF page like this, um, I can go to tools and I can rotate it. So there, now it's, now it's sideways. <laughs> it's the right orientation. Um, if it, if it were one of those, um, landscape handouts. So, um, those are your different options for um, saving and downloading individual um, Canva files from a bundle.